What's going on everybody? Hair here and yes, here we are once again. I said I wouldn't do it, but I'm going to do it. Is Bray Wyatt coming back with this brand new vignette, the White Rabbit vignette? Is it Bray Wyatt? I'm going to say no for now, um, but there is some interesting signs. Now, if you're asking me gun to my head, I definitely think it's carrying cross, but there's a few different attributes, few different objectives I have for that. Um, why it is, why it isn't. So um, the obvious points that people are thinking is Bray Wyatt, you have this mysterious thing. People think the font is related to one of his old shirts. Um, the whole you did thing, who killed the world and says you did um, in the vignette, in the QR code, whatever. So this thing popped off this Monday night on Raw, but it has been happening for the last, I don't know, two weeks or so in house shows during commercial breaks. The whole stadium or whatever, the whole um, arena is dark. People have the little fireflies out, like the old Bray Wyatt stuff. And then um, White Rabbit is playing the, the 1960s song. And it's very eerie, too. It's chilling uh, to an extent. It's a cappella playing. Um, and the interesting part when it's playing, uh, in the part where she says, uh, feed your head, the lights turn red on the entrance part. And when you think of red, you think of fiend not really carrying cross but the rest of it uh, and also to the, the the red circle in the vignette you think full circle Bray White's been tweeting that posting that for a while but the rest of it is carrying cross to me the white rabbit itself he was called the white rabbit in um lucha underground did a lot of research last night and um not only that but his whole rabbit crew they came out to feed your head that song they've been playing for the last couple weeks so not only is it that song that they're playing, it's the White Rabbit itself that was carrying cross, and they have the hourglass symbol on the vignette too. All carrying cross signs. So I hate to be the bearer of bad news. I think it's carrying cross, and I think it's carrying cross bringing his crew, the, L the Lucha Underground crew, Paul London, and maybe someone else who knows. Um, Paul London is a uh, friend of Triple H, so that makes a lot of sense. He's bringing back a lot of his buddies. Um, and again, you, you, you can argue, well, Karrion Cross debut, he re-debuted like a month ago, so why would they do this? They might repackage him, and he might want this, he might be excited for this, who knows? The only part of me that thinks, oh, Bray Wyatt is involved because of the red circle, because of the, whole, of the rabbit spelled out demon, and the whole red entrance part, is if he's part of Karrion Cross's crew, which I think Bray Wyatt's a little too big for that. I don't know why they would do that. Um, but there's no reason... This can't be Bray Wyatt by himself because it would rip off Karrion Cross's old thing, old character too much. White Rabbit itself, the song, the White Rabbit, um, and then the hourglass symbol. So it's too much of Karrion Cross to just be Bray Wyatt. Uh, again, it's if, if it's Bray, that'd be fantastic. I'm not holding my breath. I've already told myself over and over and over again with the Edge stuff. They wasted those awesome vignettes for Edge just coming back with a brand new T-shirt. It's ridiculous. So. If it's Bray joining Cross, that could be interesting, but they need a part eventually. They need to have a feud eventually because Bray's, Bray's a solo character. The Fiend is a solo character. The Eater of Worlds is a solo character, not to be in conjunction with Cross. And Cross is a great character too, but I don't think they should, if they do, if, if for whatever reason Bray joins Cross, this should be a temporary thing, of course, and then they can feud. Um, but I do think it's just Cross and his old white rabbit crew all the signs of pointing that like pointing to that like i said the song the literally the the song that they've been playing white rabbit the whole white rabbit thing that was carrying cross's name um and the hourglass like i said so the rest of it you can say maybe bray white's part of it i i'm not holding my breath to it um we shall see though if they were to come if he were to come back and were to join cross that'd be an awesome moment but i'm not holding my breath um, again, hate to be the bearer of bad news. I'm a huge Fiend slash Bray Wyatt fan. I like Cross too, but I don't want to get my hopes up for this. I do. All signs are pointing to Cross and the White Rabbit crew. The Rabbit crew. Hate to be the bearer of bad news. I hope I'm wrong. I hope Bray Wyatt's involved. 923. It was in blue in the vignette in the QR code. That means this Friday on SmackDown. Maybe we'll find out more. But again, all signs are pointing to Cross and his crew, and maybe Bray Wyatt's part of it. Who knows? This is a hair.